Imagine if you could charge your Tesla in half the time, or you can get twice the power out of your wind turbine using the same power electronics. Using today's technology, you can't. And why? Because of thermal overloading. My name is Lesser Rosendale. I'm professor at the Department of Energy Technology at Aalborg University in Denmark. We've developed a concept to relieve this constraint based on a novel implementation of thermoelectric cooling. It shows a lot of potential and we have a working prototype in the lab. We're now ready to move into real applications. In our device, we use a hybrid approach. We couple a microstructured heat sink with a thermoelectric cooler and we couple those directly to the semiconductor chip. By this, we can increase power density by a factor of two and a half. We can reduce thermal oscillations by 70%. And we can bring the average operating temperature of the power module down to ambient or near ambient conditions. All of this reduces lifetime and maintenance requirements. The method or the concept works by pulsing an electric current through the thermoelectric module at a frequency which is matched to the modular frequency of the power electronics. And this is the core novelty of the concept. Possible application areas include, uh, for example, in power generation from uh, in, in wind power, um, mobile high temperature electronics, uh, digging, drilling machines, uh, industrial electronics, uh, high power uh, lasers and LEDs, or mobile uh, robust compact electronics such as in electrical vehicles. So if you think this is interesting, please give us a call.